Okay, hey friends, I've had these for a couple of weeks now. Um, this was a collaborative uh, project that I did with Jen Cassell and Michelle Randolph. We decided we were going to do, um, we talked about doing a December daily, but we didn't get around to mailing them out till January. <laughs> so I'm going to do it like a winter occasionally because I don't feel like this paper line, this is the feeling frosty line. I don't feel like it's necessarily Christmassy. It could be just wintry. So that's my plan for this. So we each made three pages for each person to use. So that's gonna to come together to make a collaborative journal. So I thought I would make this like a two part video so it doesn't get too long. I wanted to show what these ladies made and in the next video, I'm gonna show you how I'm gonna bind them all together. Okay, so let's start with, I believe this stack is from, let's see, who's this, who's here? I think this one's from Michelle. They just came in, so she did put, look at the little charms she used. And her, I don't know what to call these beads. They're like, they have like a rubbery texture to them, but the, the beads she used in these were just like perfect. So we had some specifications to follow. I, I'm the one who made them up and I don't remember what they were. <laughs> she had to use like some trim and you had to do like a clip and blah, blah, blah. But anyway, they turned out super cute. Like I had no worries with these ladies. Look at the sweater she stuck in there. Isn't that cute? Little pockets. This paper line, super cute. Um, Jen suggested we used it, and as soon as Michelle and I looked at it, we were like, yep, we're in. That's just adorable. So, there's her, one of her pages. I love how she did this one with this big snowflake. This is her flip element, and it has like a magnet. You heard that in there. I think that might be my favorite. It's so cute. And there's the inside. And she used one of these big tags to make another flip like that. There's the back with lots of tags and cute little laces and stuff. And then her third page. Look at the cute little snowman. It's perfect. Uh, she stuck like this cute little um, like notebook in the front, which is perfect for journaling, obviously. All these trims. This is the first one she said she's done. So um, knock it out of the park on your first try, why don't you? <laughs> Beginner's luck, maybe? No, I'm kidding. Michelle's an excellent crafter. So, another flip she did. I thought this was cute. All right, so there's Michelle's pages. And then Jen sent these. Very cute. I like the torn paper look. And then each of these flip out. They're all separated. Isn't that cute? So it'd be really cute to put, you know, like a photo in there and then like journaling in those. Super cute. The back that's a good photo opportunity she made this little snowman tag there's a deer clip in there too that fell off and it's super cute she made cute clips and tags i'm sorry i'm still a little congested from this cold i cannot seem to shake and then the rona that i cannot seem to shake <laughs> it's rough guys so cute um jenna michelle and i have like an ongoing thread like Facebook chat conversation. So we always talk crafty and then we talk about whatever else gets thrown in there. <laughs> oh, look, there's the little reindeer too. Isn't it cute? I've opened these a while back, so I've kind of forgot. Now it's like looking at it all over again. Her flips are super cute. Look at that little guy. <laughs> so cute. This paper, like, look at those coffee mugs. Come on, no cocoa. So cute. All right, and then I don't think I've shown my three. I don't remember, but these are the three that I made for them. This was the most uh, difficult page I made. <laughs> so it flips up like that, and it has a big tag there. And then there's a pull-out tags here, and then it flips like this, and like that. So that's a... A great big layout for that one. It took me a while to figure out how I wanted to do that. <laughs> it also feels like this and has a huge pocket in here for it to keep goodies. And then a little double side pocket there. <clears throat> here comes Lucy again. She just can't stay out of it today. Here's my other page. It's just a card I clipped on at the top. Same thing the back side with a tag behind it, some pockets, some journaling cards. Um, I watch a lot of 
pink strawberries. Look, I got all it up. Pink strawberries um, videos. And so I got lots of ideas from her pages of what she does, and I just put them in my junk journal album. So yeah, there we go. So there's our pages, and now I've just got to decide how. Look, Michelle also made this cute little dangle for me. So cute with my name to hang off the side once I get it all bound together. So now I've got to decide how I want to bind these, and I think I've got it. So that'll be part two of the video is how to um, how I'm going to organize these and bind them all together to make one journal. I'm excited. Lucy is too. <laughs>